Hello and welcome to the video for third grade for Wednesday, April the 29th. This is going to cover the homework from our lesson, uh, second lesson, working with measuring area. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So number two, we have four rows of four. That would give us 16 square centimeters, or we could just count up each individual block. Number four, we have gaps here, so we can't use multiplication by itself. Um, we could kind of start by doing four rows of five, and then we add our extra two. We can just count across or from top to bottom, and that would give us our 22 square centimeters. Number six, explain how to find the area of a square using tiles. Well, the easiest way and what we've been doing the most often, for instance here, is just count the number of tiles. So however you want to explain that. And I did in a different version of this video <laughs> promise that I would probably do this. Um, I forgot to prep for this because I didn't want to erase and redraw. Um, the number of square feet that are shaded are going to be our gray. And then for the second question, we would also ask how many are shaded in white. And so I mentioned um, in that version that uh, it looked like it could be a weird looking like face of a cat or something like that. So uh, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23 square feet for the amount shaded in. And then we have uh, 5, 8, 11, 14, 19 uh, for the area that's not shaded in. So the problems for the homework. If you have any questions, please feel free uh, to ask in Google Classroom. This is a really short video. I think you guys uh, probably will be able to understand this. This is um, the way they uh, teach it in Go Math. I actually like it a little bit better, uh, even though this is my first time using these lessons. Uh, normally, I just use the Performance Coach Math book for it, um, but those lessons also do a really good job. So um, on Thursday, we will have our new lesson. So I uh, hope you have a great day and I will see you tomorrow.